to show off a small project of mine, a native iOS application that lets the user access his mailbox on a Oxford powered social network site and send and receive messages. So this is our project in Xcode. Uh, and here you see that we are connecting to a uh, um, Oxwell powered site at this particular, particular URL. Let's fire this up and see what's going on. This is our iOS simulator and we are running this on 6.1 on a four inch retina screen. Uh, what you need to do here is to, access, to uh, provide your Oxwell username and your password. Not so very secret password in my case, but this is a demo site, so it doesn't really matter. And you see here your avatar from your Oxwell site, your uh, real name and some other information. And here you will see all your ongoing conversation listed. Whether they are incoming or outgoing, they will be listed in the same view and uh, this is the subject of the conversation and who you're having the conversation with and if we follow this link we see all the messages that me and a test user on my site have been exchanging so let's see if we can send him a little message message from ios hi let's see let's send this off and you see here that it has been sent, but let's see if it's also on the Oxwell site as well. And I'm, as you see here, I'm logged in as test user, and I s open up my uh, my um, inbox, and I am the one that started this conversation. And let's see here, message from iOS. Hi, sent from with Oxwell Messenger. That's a automatic add-on appended to uh, uh, the message that is sent from Oxwell Messenger so we can distinct which messages has originated from our app. Let's have an answer. Uh, I'm, I'm great. I'm not real. smiling. Let's send this off. And let's go back to uh, the app and have a refresh. And here you see the incoming message. So you can also start a new conversation by choosing who you want to uh, talk to. And Give a subject, new conversation, and a new message in the message field. So we have small technical problems still with this app. Sometimes it uh, crashes. That's because we are not quite done yet. Uh, but anyway, if you'd like to check it out, uh, you go to github.com, uh, where you have all the source code. You can download the zip. And you can also fork this repository if you are a member of GitHub. And remember, this is a true open source project, so you can do whatever you want with it. Uh, we have a website where you can see some more information about it. And that's uh, in this um, particular URL. This is still a proof of concept. Remember that uh, we will go in production, but it will take a while. If you want to have more information about this project, you don't hesitate to contact me. Uh, my email is on my profile and a link to the website and the repository will be in the comments. I hope I talk to you some other day and thank you for watching. Bye bye.